A pandemic unleashed by humans resulted in the emergence of mutants, a terrible new race. Dr. Hartmuth Grisgram turns on his cursed human factory to construct the prototype Sturm Front military. Players take on the role of Side Fried von Hammerstein, a one-of-a-kind semi-organic fighting force tasked with annihilating mutants. The game involves burning with a flamethrower, looking for buried souls to discover the roots of the mutant conflict and defeating huge adversaries. The game incorporates features of bullet hell and provides a traditional arcade gaming experience. The plot is around a fairy tale quest in which the forest's goddess lies dormant and elves use the goddess's silver axe to resurrect it. The final chapter will decide the result of the adventure. The silver axe derives its strength from the goddess herself. Players must select their course and overcome obstacles in order to rescue the forest. The game employs innovative elemental gameplay, allowing players to mix forces such as wind, thunder, earth, and fire to gain new abilities. In addition, players encounter 17 different boss battles, each with its unique story and gameplay systems. The game is a side-scrolling action adventure in which the heroine, Amala, utilizes a forbidden magical sword to defeat demons. To fight bosses, players employ swordplay and spellcasting to cut through enemy hordes and methodically tear down their defenses. The game provides an exciting experience with customizable clothing, realistic damage effects on costumes, and a training option to hone battle tactics. The instructional mode allows players to study the game's features and use input support to direct Amila's activities. Pac-Man World Repack puts a modern spin on the original game, with an improved user interface, revised gaming mechanics, and updated visuals. Players traverse ghosts, face environmental difficulties, and complete platforming objectives. The game has 3D mazes, a quest mode, and the trademark power pellet. Players will meet new ghost characters with distinct powers and challenges. On Ghost Island, they may explore themed areas, participate in online leaderboards, and challenge friends and people from all over the world. Arietta of Spirits takes players on a compelling journey with a poignant story, interesting gameplay and exciting fighting scenes. Explore the enigmatic island's verdant forests, shadowy caverns, and hidden mysteries. Appreciate the visually attractive retro-style pixel graphics and immersive original soundtrack. Engage with interesting individuals and discover the deep background. Battle with a wide range of foes utilizing responsive battle techniques. The game has accessible gaming mechanisms appropriate for gamers of all skill levels. Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch is a game that immerses players in a magical environment. The plot follows Oliver, a teenage protagonist who is on a mission to save his mother after a sad event. The game boasts breathtaking animation. The game's mood and emotional depth are heightened by the captivating graphics and lovely audio composition. The game is an extraordinary role-playing journey that will leave gamers of all ages with wonderful memories. The game's compelling tale, stunning graphics, and sweeping orchestral composition make it a must-play for Level 5 fans. You might just be able to stop him, see? You really think I can? Tales of Vesperia Definitive Edition celebrates the popular game's 10th anniversary. The Empire rules the game in a culture that relies on old Blastia technology. In an epic story, the fates of two friends become entangled. The Definitive Edition includes additional music tracks, mini-games, difficult bosses, and a special selection of previously unavailable outfit DLC. Patty Fleur and Flynn Skyfo, two new playable characters, join the gang, bringing excitement to the game. The 30XX is an exciting action platformer game that mixes old principles with current roguelike aspects to provide limitless replay value. It has thrilling action scenes, precise platforming puzzles, and amazing sprite work. Each character has a distinct playstyle, allowing players to learn skills and explore sophisticated systems. The game's ever-changing nature ensures that no two playthroughs are the same, 
and its roguelike advancement system allows players to fine-tune their gameplay. 30x Hex has both local and online multiplayer possibilities, which improves the whole experience. Gunborg Dark Matters is a space-themed platformer featuring arcade-style gameplay and furious action. Players must traverse an extraterrestrial spacecraft filled with hazardous monsters and bosses. Players must conquer the spacecraft and defeat its defenders with a strong blade and shield. Fun arcade-style action, three difficulty settings, the ability to handle enemy weapons, a formidable shield for deflecting bullets, and the power of dark energy to improve weapons are among the key elements. Book of Demons is a one-of-a-kind game that combines hack and slash with deck-building principles, allowing players to create their own missions. Players utilize magic cards to combat the darkness in the old cathedral dungeons and liberate the paperverse from the archdemon's grasp. The game employs cards to represent things, spells, and skills, with legendary cards being the most difficult. The Flexiscope engine is used to break gameplay into sessions, which adapt to the player's speed. For those looking for a challenge outside of the main game, free play mode provides a hard attempt. Discover the mysteries buried behind the walls of Beret Manor, where the gloomy fog conceals terrible secrets just waiting to be disclosed. The psychotic occupants will stop at nothing to safeguard their distorted world making your task even more dangerous to defend yourself from the horrific monsters lurking in the shadows. Arm yourself with your trusty Aito Kane and Waltham A9 hand cannon. Prepare for a voyage that will test the bounds of your sanity as you go further into the fog-shrouded mansion. The truth awaits, but at what cost will it be disclosed? Counter GM is a 2D shooter with a top-down scrolling mode. Players may charge their counter gauge by approaching enemy bullets, which they can then utilize to deliver deadly assaults. Destroying foes with these special attacks will reward players with stars. When the break gauge hits the maximum level, players can engage break mode to gain a momentary yet powerful firepower increase. The game also has seven stages, four difficulty levels, four distinct narrative modes, 16 ship types to choose from, boss rush mode, and a mission mode to teach players the game's tips and tactics. Evil, and I'm stopping it right now. Indivisible is an action RPG game that features hand-drawn artwork and novel real-time battle elements. A brave young girl reared in a remote community who is woken by an attack on her house. The game's huge fantasy world characters and graphic design are inspired by several civilizations and mythology. She encounters several incarnations that she may summon to battle with her. Each incarnation has its own tale and personality, and she must learn how to rescue the planet she lives in. The game's high quality and diversified universe make it an engaging experience for gamers. Machine Draymon isn't the only threat. Digimon World Next Order is an RPG in which players are digi-destined to restore order in the digital world after Machine Dramon has taken over. The goal is to discover and enlist as many devoted Digimon partners as possible in order to reconstruct the digital world. Players can select a male or female protagonist and take on adventures with over 200 Digimon to acquire. To avoid greater devastation, they must strike a balance between training and exploration. Players may create Flotaya, a bustling town where they can recruit new Digimon, renovate buildings, cultivate crops, and more. Together, your bond will bring you to victory. The Kark Isles, a collection of islands near Riza's village, pose a threat to their home. Riza and her pals uncover ancient ruins with a massive gate, which encourages her to learn the code of the universe. The gate's significance remains unknown. Ryza and her allies go on an epic journey involving a key and the roots of alchemy. The game has 11 party members, including familiar characters from past games and new crucial players. The players can also join a diverse group of companions, providing a greater sense of independence.
Halloween bloodstained ritual of the night describes itself as a gothic horror action side-scrolling RPG set in 18th century England. In this creepy atmosphere, a paranormal force has created a castle plagued with demons where crystal shards infused with enormous magical power are revealed. Along the journey, players have the ability to acquire construct and unlock a vast assortment of weapons, equipment, and riches vital for fighting the endless swarms of infernal minions and dangerous monsters that lie in wait. Miriam sets off on a treacherous trip through the castle to save mankind and her own life. In Senses, you may experience the excitement of solving the secrets of the Midnight Door in Ikebukuro Walking Park. Dive into the heart-pounding realm of survival horror, complete with classic tank controls and fixed camera angles, all done in a vintage style reminiscent of genre classics. Immerse yourself in the real Japanese atmosphere as you explore ghostly activity and negotiate a labyrinth of terrifying legends. With limited inventory spaces to manage, riddles to complete, and malevolent ghosts to avoid, every choice you make might spell the difference between life and death. Suen Yuan's Sword 7 is an action role-playing game that mixes ancient Chinese history and mythology with current technology. Players assume the role of Tai Shi Zhao, a swordsman who must protect his family while also uncovering a catastrophic blight. The game provides a cinematic narrative in which players learn fighting tactics such as slicing, blocking, evading, and reposting. The Elysium Scroll enables players to manipulate time, absorb creatures, and transform their surroundings. The game's solo tale allows players to completely immerse themselves in the narrative.